everybody, it's Danny, and today I have got my Play by Sephora for November, and this month's theme was Best in Glow. This is, oh, nothing right there, and then the inside the products and a little bit about them, like how to use it. Pro tips. Oh, it even has a thing that says the way it glows. And yeah, I really, really like that. Okay, so the first sample I'm going to show you is the perfume sample. And this is a little freebie every month. Um, Play by Sephora is a um, $10 a month like beauty box subscription like Birchbox or Ipsy. But you only get stuff they sell at Sephora which actually I really, really like, which is why I got it. But they give you five uh, travel size um, samples because they're travel size products and one perfume sample every month. Um, the perfume sample doesn't count towards your five products, which is why I like it so much because I really, really don't like getting perfume, sam perfume samples. But this month, is by Stella McCarthy and it's called Pop and a full size of this retails for it does not say I thought this thing said how much it was last time maybe I'm wrong all right never mind then I don't know how much a full size of this is um, but it comes like this, and what I do like about this one is that it has a little spritzer on top instead of like a little stick or just nothing, but I don't like how it smells, <coughs> which is not a big surprise. I never like how these things smell, ever. I have two perfumes that I like, and I really never like anything else, plus I think this would really, really upset my husband's allergies because it's really floral, and florals kind of send them into a tizzy. But I don't like it. But again, if you liked it, awesome for you. I just didn't. I do appreciate the, the spritzer, though, on top. I think all perfume samples should be like that. Now on to the stuff I actually care about. This is the this month's bag. It says, glow, it says the glow getter. <laughs> Play on words. And I really do like the bag. I ruin them every month though because there's supposed to be a black like ribbon like drawstring and every month as soon as I open it it just I mess it all up because apparently I can't open a bag but I love it the bags are really cute though and I'm just gonna kind of dump them out first thing you always get is you get this little card now this card is really cool because it tells you everything that's in the box and whatnot and then also, if you have a Sephora near you, there are a couple near me, but I use, I never go to Sephora, I always just buy online. But if you take this card into Sephora with you the next time you go, um, they can scan it and it gives you 50 extra um, beauty points. So that's pretty cool. I should really start going to the Sephora's near me. <laughs> and it says that it doesn't matter how small your purchase is. So, that's pretty cool. The first thing, I'm actually kind of excited about this, is this little guy. And this is the Dissolve the Drama uh, Makeup Remover Plus Cleanser by the Estee Edit. And I've never tried anything by um, Estee Edit, or even, I don't think, by es um, Estee Lauder in general but I know this is like their new line that's geared more towards like the younger crowd and this is a nice size this is half an ounce and it says here it's an innovative two-in-one makeup remover and oil cleanser transforms into a luxurious silky oil to a nutri um, uh, nurturing uh, words milky foam that leaves skin fresh and luminous so that's really cool. It says you can massage a small amount into dry skin to help break up stubborn makeup. 
and then add a little bit of water to turn the oil into a milky cleanser and then rinse it off. So that is really nice and that's a pretty, you know, that's, oh, almost dropped it. <laughs> that's a good size. Like you're going to know if you like it. Definitely. So that's cool. That's another thing I like about Sephora, the Play by Sephora, is they give you pretty um, decent sizes of everything. The next thing is by Cover FX. And this is their Illuminating Primer Base. It says, glow-inducing silicone-free primer preps the skin with light-reflecting uh, mineral complex that helps eliminate dullness. I have never tried, I don't think I've ever tried anything by Cover Effects, but don't quote me because I could be wrong. I might have something, I don't know. But as far as I know, I know I've never tried their primer. So that's pretty cool. And again, pretty nice size. I don't know how much is actually in this tube. Like, because when I put it up to light, I, it, the light doesn't penetrate the tube, so I don't know, like, where the fill line is on it, but still, pretty nice size. Um, the next thing I'm not really excited about, but I do like that they put it in here, and that is this lip gloss. This is from the Sephora brand, and this is their their gel gloss, the Ultra Shine, Ultra Shine Lip Gel, and this is in the color Pin Up Pink. Um, I don't wear a lot of gloss, but that's not really what gets me here. It's the color. This is a really, like, it's showing a little bit, um, lighter on camera, but this is, like, kind of a hot pink. This, like, this is, like, a Barbie pink lip gloss, and that's just not my jam. I'm more of a neutrals and nudes type of person, so I'm not even gonna, un I'm not gonna unwrap it or swatch it or anything. I love the size of it. It's very, very, a very generous you know, like half size tube. Um, and I do like, I've never tried Sephora's lip glosses, but I do like their lip stick. So I'm sure this is great. Just wish it was a different color. So I'm probably going to give that to a friend or something. I'm not even going to unwrap it. The next thing I'm actually super excited about, and it is by Glam Glow, which is a great, you can't see that, <laughs> which is a great, 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 great sample to get. Um, and this is the Super Mud Clearing Treatment, which I have never tried and actually have been wanting to try. And you get 0.3 ounces in this, which is a generous size, considering a 1.7 ounce container of this costs $69 and a and point and half an ounce of this costs $22. So this is almost $22 worth of product. Almost. So that's pretty cool. And well worth the ten dollars I paid for the bag. Um, so yeah, what's that say right there? Okay, it has eucalyptus eucalyptus leaf in this, so if you're allergic to that, beware. But it says skin clearing mud mask with activated charcoal draws out dirt and impurities while also helping to brighten and soften. So that's pretty cool. And the very last thing, which is actually one of the things I'm probably, sorry, I'm back. Um, so the next thing, which is probably the thing I'm the most excited about of all of it is this little guy right here. And this is the caviar, the caviar stick eye color from Laura Mercier in the color rose gold. And let's see what it says for this. Multi-purpose high pigment eyeshadow stick glides on and blends easily for transfer, pu transfer proof all day wear. Awesome. And I have actually been wanting to try these. I actually have a, I think it's a set of like four or five of them, like a holiday set of them that I wanted. I don't know if this color is in that set, but I know I've been wanting to try these. And, uh, oh my gosh. It says on here that you get one gram of product, and this is, there you go, that's how much you get, and honestly, that's pretty decent, like, that's really decent for, you know, an eyeshadow thing, and then again, in the color rose gold, let me give you a nice swatch, ooh, those are really creamy, okay, I, like there that'll be a really pretty color I think it's nice and shiny 
and it's not super gold, which is great. See, that would look, I think, kind of gaudy on my eyes, but I really like this color. This is probably my favorite thing out of the entire bag, and this is probably my second favorite thing out of the bag. So, I love it. I can't wait to try that out. That is really, really pretty. And again, like, they're nice and soft, and they, I think they would easily be buildable and you work with them really nicely. I like that a lot. So that is my Sephora Play bag. I really liked everything in it. Um, even the lip gloss that I know I'm not going to use it. Um, but I do like, I still like, you know, I like the sample even though it's not my color. I think it's a great sample or travel size option or whatever. And yeah, I'm going to continue to get this. I don't think I'm ever going to unsubscribe from this one. Um, I still have a couple of birch boxes before that one ends, and I don't have any more birch boxes. And then tomorrow I'm going to have a Sephora haul from the um, VIB sale that just ended on the 14th. I got two of my orders today, and I'm getting one tomorrow, so I figured I'd just wait. They were really small orders, so it's not going to be a very long haul. Um, and then Friday I will be popping on probably and making a video because Friday I'm getting my hair done and I want to show you guys all what it looks like when it's all done. It's going to get all cut and colored and my hair's long and I don't like it. So time for a change. All right. And I will see everyone then. I'll talk to you later. Hope you enjoyed this video. Bye.